<laughs> Hello, this is Matt Freilak, and we've got another exciting show for you today. Matter of fact, we're going to be combining three of my favorite things of all time. Flaming nachos, go-karts, and a little danger. As you can see, the first thing you want to start out is with, you know, just your basic corn tortilla. Now this baby, the reciprocating saw, good for anything, tearing out, ripping out, pleasuring your wife, whatever you need it for, it'll take care of it all. Cotton wood, cotton metal, it does it all. It's pleasuring your wife, whatever you need it for. Hey, wait a minute, you're not normal. But today, we're gonna use it to chop these babies up. Now, the first thing you gotta know, these things start to flop around a little bit, so you just wanna set the saw. Get slow. And mom, you see that? Have you seen those babies flying out of there? Now we're gonna be introducing the yin of to the yang of the nacho and cheese. Nachos and cheese would not be complete unless you have this item right here. We're gonna stack these babies. I think I've got five stacked up. That's cheesy goodness right there, ladies and gentlemen. If you're gonna do it, let's do it. Let's just let's not kick it around. Let's let's make ourselves some nachos. Yeah, for me, I don't want to connect with them. I want them to connect with me. That's idiotic, dude. Front though, just like a deck of cards. Boom. The cheese portion. The cheese. But for those of you that absolutely delicious. So you just want to spread that around the nachos. Get a little bit over the cheese. It doesn't matter if you make a mess, it's alright. Yeah, that's looking gorgeous already, baby. Now, for the creme de la creme. Gotta take a little Bacardi 151. I generally don't put my nachos and cheese in the oven. I cook it from the top on down. All you need is anything that's flammable, preferably something that's edible. We're gonna take this baby, we got something special. My brother Joe's gonna be joining us on the show. He's gonna get the go-kart off. We're gonna light these babies on fire. He's gonna jump them. People, back it up. We got a mountain of nachos and cheese coming through here. Back it up. I've known this man my whole life. We started out in the sandbox together. He's the daredevil of the family. And we're gonna be combining two of our favorite things. Stunt work combined with food, fire, and flame. You need a flame up here about two feet. Yeah. We need to get you some more Bigger is better, I agree. You oh. are correct. Oh. We need bigger flame, bigger jump. Cause the elation's like catching that first feet. All right, let's light this baby up. Let's get you over this baby, Joe. Let's roll. All right. You know, Joe. As I said earlier in the show, you know, at one point there's six million people on planet Earth and I think you are the first man in all human history to run a go-kart over a big mountain of flaming nachos. And Brother Matthew, you know we prefer it that way. <laughs> Pushing the envelope. We've made the meal. I think it's time we should have a big bite out of it. We like our nachos well done. Let me get my microphone in Scooper there. Super large, Matthew. Oh. <sighs> Unbelievable. Ha <laughs> ha!